Yo, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to the Countdown to Sonic Mania here on the YTOS. And oh my god, is that chaos? How many emeralds do you have, my boy? One, two, three. Oh no! I couldn't count. Not again! This is Chaos 6? Chaos? Could this be the same beast? <laughs> oh yes! Attack Sonic! No! Froggy? Froggy? I must say Froggy! Oh no, his frog! If he's your friend, I'll help you! Okie dokie! Just leave it to me! <laughs> now I have six of the Chaos Emeralds! There's only one more left to oh, find! Man. I even found Chaos's missing tail! You won't get away with this, you madman! I will! You're no match for Chaos, even though he's not perfected yet! Okay, Chaos, destroy them all immediately! Oh, man. Imperfect Chaos. <laughs> Alright, so this is Chaos 6. He has six of the seven Chaos Emeralds. He should be pretty much indestructible, but he's not. We can defeat him. He's trying to eat us in this little section here. And the way that you beat him, because Eggman is actually assisting Chaos, you have to destroy these little little freaking orbs, throw it at Chaos, and it freezes. Him. No way! I can't believe it. Can attack. All right, so that was that was a normal attack. You saw how much damage I did. Let me show you how much damage the light speed attack does. So I can get it off. No way! I Watch can't this. believe this! See how much more damage the light speed attack does? That thing hurts, man. One more and he's dead. I think you can beat him in two hits if you, uh, if you use the light speed attack. I can't attack this thing. Uh oh. Come on, drop it. Ah! I don't think Eggman can actually hurt me. No way! I can't believe this! And he's done. Hey, I'll play with you some other time. So even with six chaos emeralds, chaos is no match for us. I mean, no Eggman kind way! Of, I can't believe this! <laughs> Sonic! Hey, it's Knuckles! Hey there, Knuckles! Glad you finally made it! I thought you got lost or something. Well, you're a little late to the party, my boy. Until we meet again, Sonic! Stop! Come back here! And Knuckles just, just stands idly by. And Sonic just jumps off of the egg carrier. Because apparently fall damage is not a thing in the Sonic universe. We already fell head first into sand. And now it looks like we're gonna fall head or face first into solid ground. And we're we're totally fine. Uh, I hate Eggman. Where's this? We're in the Mystic Ruins, but where are we? If you notice, you can see uh, like a little like Knuckles Clan or Echidna. Like sculptures and stuff. Hmm? Hey, look, it's our guide. Look, that it's light. Trying to show me something. I think it's trying to show me something. Oh yeah. Okay. There you go, son. He's on point. All right, so now we can play as big, which we will never do. No, <laughs> I may get to him one one day. Um, stage nine, the Lost World. All right, go to the center of the ruins. This level is okay. I mean, there's there's a, a huge platforming section toward the end, and this camera angle, like, where's my boy? That, um, you know, the platforming section I, I can deal without, but I mean, for the most part, this zone is actually, or this action stage, I keep wanting to call them zones and acts, but this is an action stage. This, this place is actually pretty cool. 
Ow! I don't know if there's a way to like actually just like dip through here and get hit. It's like what face. I love Sonic's run animation in this game. I really do. Whoa! Almost fell into a bed of spikes. Alright, so this section kind of blows. And I guess this can be considered uh, the only like real water level in this game. Uh, hitting these buttons will raise the water level. And then uh, it puts Sonic in this little like mode. You have to jump on top of the stake and get to the next or the top of the next section. I believe. Where are we going? Yeah, there we go. Because we have to hit these three buttons. There's three buttons that we need to hit, so we have one down. Raise the water level. I'm sure there's a faster way to do this, but whatever. We're just gonna do it the way it was intended. Riding this freaking like stone s snake thing. How is it even swimming? I don't know. Right, so let's raise the water level, and we're actually gonna cheese this part by just jumping over here. I really didn't feel like going all the way around again. Alright, so we jump on the snake and it will take us to the door that we just opened. Like really, how are you swimming, my boy? No idea. Whoa, whoa, I'm being I'm being pulled away. I don't want to fall off. Whoa, camera, what's what's happening? I can't see a damn thing. Alright, there we go. Jeez. Super, super wonky. Use the mirror to help guide you. Okay, so things kind of slow down in this area. As you can see, everything is pitch black up there. But if you point the light at the mirror, it kind of illuminates uh, things a little bit. Be careful with these little like arrows; they can hit you. They really look harmless. Let's grab a shield. This way? No, let's go this way. Ah, electric shield. Nice. Alright, a little bit of platforming here. There we go. Not too hard. Alright, so you want to make sure you get your light speed dash ready because the rings will, like, home in on you even if, uh, <laughs> like, when you need them to not do that. That's the one thing about the electric shield and the light speed dash is that sometimes when you need the rings to like be in place so that you can use them to travel, they freaking come towards you. So you gotta be careful there. It's actually a... Oh god! Thank you, Rock, for slowing down for me. <laughs> little Indiana Jones type scene here. I, I like this part. Oh, what? That thing hit me! Ugh! Yes, good thing you can jump in the air after you get hit. Otherwise, we would have died right before a checkpoint. Ah! Can we get that shield up there? I don't like that. There we go. Yo, camera. Oh, I think those are more bots. Alright, so this section is a little weird. What you have to do is hit these buttons. When they're dark blue like this, you can walk on them. Okay, so this thing is gonna come. In. There we go. Whoa, chill. Okay, so just walk on the, alongside the walls until we get to where we need to go. There's a checkpoint there. Just grab it. Oh no! Uh, damn it. No! Ah, oh, keep falling. I just fell all the way back down. Alright, let's get back up there. 40 rings. Wow. That's a lot of rings to be in, like, one capsule. 
want to spin dash jump my way up here. I can. Man, almost. Here we go. I love the spin dash in the game. If I haven't already established that. Where does this take us? Whoa! Come on, boys. Really? Oh, that just takes us. Uh, no, yeah, we can go this way. We'll stay on the first one. Oh. totally cheese this area, but it's whatever. I'll go through the motions just because, otherwise this level could be beaten in like a few minutes. Ooh, lots of spike traps, fire traps. We don't want nothing to do with that. I normally never take this, this long route that we just took. Whoa! Yeah, I kind of just, I could have just spin dash jumped my way into this little area. But you need to go here. And that's yes. the end of the stage. I'm not sure why they, like, had, like, another, like, theme and everything. You don't even get to hear it. You go, you enter this door and then that's it. Yeah, not bad. All right, we're at the center of the room. So what do we have here? What What's going on here? Oh, it's our, our guide. Looks good. Wow, what's this? What is it? A mural. A mural. So it's showing an ancient prophecy. A dragon-like creature will destroy everything. And then we get teleported. Hey, it's the uh, the shrine to the master. Remember, I showed that to you guys. What's this place? Where am I? I really this like is really weird. Uh, the lighting in this area. Like it's supposed to indicate that like shit is on fire. Uh, can we go back here? I kind of want to explore a little bit. I don't think we can actually go back here though. Maybe we can. Yeah. Now nah, we can't go back there. That's a that's a separate area. We're basically in the land of the Knuckles clan. Yeah, and as you can see the shrine is on fire. These little dead creatures on the floor here, those are chows. <laughs> Sorry to introduce them in such a negative light, but um, yeah, this is actually the first time we get to see them. As if you don't go to the child gardens. Why? Why indeed? Who did this? Why did this have to happen? It's terrible. It, it is, I agree. I agree 100%. I must stop this now. How are you gonna do that, girly? It's the Master Emerald. The Master Emerald um, plays a very important role in this game and its sequel, Sonic Adventure 2. And um, in the beginning of the game. What was that all about? No, I'll explain. Hold on. I don't think I'm dreaming here. Hmm? What the? Eggman! Where's he going? What's he doing here? Oh, never mind. This time I'll get him good! Yo, Sonic is pissed! <laughs> uh, so what I was gonna say is, um, in the, um, in Knuckles' story, it actually shows what happens before the beginning of, of Sonic's, uh, story, when he fights Chaos for the first time. Um, I did mention that Eggman tried to steal the Master Emerald, but, um, yeah, I mean that that pretty much that was pretty much it, you know. Eggman tries to steal the Master Emerald before going after the Chaos Emeralds. And I always liked coming up here because you can kind of get a full layout of the land. 
that uh, I don't know if you can if you guys can see it, but over there is the uh, the way back to you know towards Station Square, and over here is where we need to go. I'm not sure what this is supposed to be. It's like some kind of like monorail system that takes you to like the center of Eggman's like base. That's Eggman's base is where we're going. And it's not like he's trying to keep now, it a secret. Now this is more like it. Yeah, this is more like it. Yeah, I like this view. But um, yeah, it's not like he's trying to hide it or anything. It's in plain sight and it has like searchlights and everything. It's like, what the hell is the matter with you, guy? But uh, <laughs> anyway, we will head in that direction in the very next episode. I uh, hope you guys are enjoying yourselves. I'm enjoying playing this game. I, I, I really am. And uh, I hope to see you guys uh, in the next episode. Uh, so until then, my name is Trinell. This is the Countdown to Sonic Mania. And I'm out of here. Peace out.